of Jesus in the New Testament. Jesus says in Matthew chapter 10, and again, we're focusing on that other side of the coin that doesn't quite honestly, doesn't often get much screenplay um, in our pulpits and lecterns uh, and on Christian TV and in Christian um, uh, uh, discipleship materials, uh, printed materials today. Um, Jesus says, don't think that I came to bring peace on earth. I did not come to bring peace but a sword, and to set every man against his brother, etc. Why is this? Because truth oftentimes does separate, does divide. Um, this is a passage that some people may not even know is in the Bible, quite honestly, but there it is in Matthew chapter 10 and on the lips of Jesus. And yet there's the other side. In the Gospel of John chapter 14, Jesus says to us, peace I leave with you, my peace I am giving to you, and it's not as the world gives, but this is God's, this is Jesus' peace. So don't let your heart be troubled. Don't let it be fearful. Um, so which is it? Is it Matthew 10 or is it John 14? My answer personally would be yes, absolutely. It's Matthew 10 and it's John 14, and lots of other passages that indicate that this is the nature of of the incarnate in the flesh, Jesus, in the same way that it was the, um, uh, the God of the Hebrew Bible, the God of the Old Testament, we would call it God, our, call him God the Father at that point. The same two aspects included within the same being, in the same nature.